Hi guys, uh, today I'm going to review an award-winning short film called Umbrella. So it's a story about a boy who's living at an orphanage and uh, it starts at a rainy day and there's a mother-daughter who drive into the orphanage to donate a box of toys. So this mother-daughter have a very unique yellow umbrella and we see that the boy looks at the umbrella and he immediately likes it. So they come in, they're donating toys to the children and the girl notices that the umbrella is gone. So she followed the traces of the umbrella, you know, because umbrella was wet, they came from outside. So she followed the traces of it and then she sees that a boy is trying to hide it in a cupboard. So they have a little fight and they open the cupboard and all the books and everything falls out from the cupboard. Then because of the noise, the mother and the, I think the orphanage teacher or the caretaker, they both rush up and they, then they see that, you know, they have like all the things are on the floor and the boy has the umbrella. So the girl, you know, snatches or takes the umbrella from the boy. And by this time, the mother notices something on the floor. It's maybe it's a photo. and It was a photo. And then we have a flashback. So in the flashback, we see that the boy was a refugee and he and his father were struggling uh, for food, for shelter, for everything. So on a rainy day, his father dropped him outside of this orphanage. And his father had a yellow muffler and a yellow umbrella. So he gave the yellow muffler. We see the, the boy with the yellow muffler throughout from like the first scene. So we see like he drops him and he gives him the muffler and uh, he goes. So that yellow umbrella was basically, you know, that boy for that boy, it brings out all those past emotions and that his like he's still waiting for his father. So that's what that yellow umbrella was about. Now after hearing or listening or imagining or knowing the background of that boy, I think the girl feels bad and she gives him and hands him the yellow umbrella. And cut to we are in the future, we see that the boy has grown old and now he owns an umbrella shop. And uh, he sells that yellow umbrella to some little kid. And then when while selling it, he sees that there's a man walking outside the window with the yellow umbrella. And he thinks he's like that man is his father. He follows him, but he's pretty old. He could not follow him and he falls down. And when he falls down, he's looking at that man going and that man slowly fades away. So basically it was maybe a memory or for me, it was like spirit going away. And then we see that someone comes in to pick him up and we can make out that that old lady is the same girl. So they both go inside the umbrella shop and in the credits we can see we can make out there are pictures like drawings and we can make out that yeah it is like they both had a love story and they ended up together so it was a great film and uh for me the inciting incident was like the setup is the boy in the room and the girl and mother in the car and i think both of them are the main protagonist because we, ha- we can see a character arc in the girl and whereas the boy also has an arc like not an arc but it's the story of the boy so like we can see the story from his point of view but the arc is like the character arc is in the girl's character so I think it's a two protagonist story and uh, the setup was the car in the room and then the inciting incident is when the boy uh, steals the umbrella and like the where, the point where the girl notices the umbrella has been stolen then whole follow up and the fight and the backstory is the crisis and I think the climax is when the girl hands him the umbrella and we can like we see the change in the girl at that point of time and then all the after story is the resolution so I really like the film and I really like the girl's character arc like she was angry and she didn't want to give away her toys and stuff to other people and in the end we see that you know she becomes more understanding and she willingly gives her umbrella to the boy so we can see that character arc and there are many scenes in the film that are like beautifully pictured like the frames are perfect there's one scene especially that I like too much like it was a metaphor for me so it, there's a scene like when the girl is like the pa- the mother and the caretaker comes up to the room where the girl and the boy are standing we see that the there, there are two windows it's like from the out, up, like the outside we see there are two windows 
and the girl and the boy are in one window and the mother and the caretaker comes in to another and we see that the girl leaves this window and joins the mother and the caretaker and we see that the boy is alone so it's like it shows how like it's beautifully shows how the boy is alone like in the window he's alone and here there are three people in this window and it like depicts the story amazingly in one frame